Hi, I'm Matt Maisie, and I founded the Rainbow Delegation back in August of 2010. If you have sent in a request for a wristband, you have most likely been in contact with me at some point. Um, I'm addressing all of you today to kind of clear up some questions that I've been recently getting more often and to give an overall state of the delegation, which is kind of like the State of the Union address, only slightly cooler. Um, and hopefully slightly more exciting, although no promises. Um, first and foremost, I'd like to thank everyone who has sent in a request for a wristband, and especially those of you who have had kind words of encouragement for me. It seems that whenever there's, you know, the stress of the, the campaign is getting a bit much, I always seem to have an email or a Facebook message that reminds me of why it is that I'm doing this. Um, I'd like to clear up some confusion. I've been getting um, the sense that a lot of people have an idea that the Rainbow Delegation is some giant corporation with headquarters and, and employees somewhere, and that's really not the case. In reality, um, it's a very grassroots movement um, run mostly by myself and a few friends, and really the Rainbow Delegation, the idea is that the Rainbow Delegation is you, and it's me and everyone else who is involved in this campaign and is out there as a visual presence of support. Just a basic update, um, so far over 17,000 wristbands have been given out and every single one of those wristbands have been given completely free of charge including shipping to anywhere in the world and we have been receiving requests from as far away as the Philippines, Germany, New Zealand and so forth. Um, when I first had this idea and I started kind of pitching it to my friends, I had a lot of people tell me that I was completely crazy and that giving away free wristbands would lead inevitably to my quick bankruptcy and I would then be unable to continue this campaign. Um, I told all of them that I truly believed that once people heard about the campaign and really got excited that the support would arise from you know normal everyday individuals and that it would continue to fuel this particular um, movement. I wanted to keep everything completely free because I didn't want anything to hinder someone from being able to get a wristband if they truly wanted one. And that would be regardless of the, their financial situation or their location. Um, word has been spreading and I have been getting a huge increase of requests. Most days I'm sending out hundreds of wristbands this is the uh, the batch being sent out today. I don't know if you can see that. But if I look a little tired, it's because I was up late finishing all those. So um, I've been speaking to a lot of high schools, college groups, and even church communities recently, and the response I've been getting has been, get, has been really, really great. Um, every single high school campus I've been to, there seems to be hundreds of students that are eager to get a wristband to show that they're some and safe and supportive. Um, I'm in contact with a lot of the LGBT students that are on those campuses and I hear all the time how much it's really helping them to see how many students and how much of their peer and even some of the staff, how much of them are supportive. Even the most you know, comfortably out of students tell me that it really boosts their self-confidence and their sense of inclusion to see people showing their support. Um, I feel very strongly about this movement and I will continue this movement as much as I am able. Um, there's been a lot of focus recently on the tragic suicides that have been occurring amongst the LGBT youth. And I can't help but think that those students that got to that point that they did take their own life, if they would have had just a few other students at their school that they could look at and say, you know, that's someone supportive and that's someone I can go to, it might have made, you know, all the difference to them. So this is something that I truly believe in, and this is something that I think that we can all really come together as a community and support. Um, this is something that everyday people like you and me can do that can actually really, truly make the difference, and perhaps all the difference to someone. Um, the reality is that this is not free for me. Actually, the majority of the, the funding comes from me for this particular campaign so far. And I'm happy to help as much as I can. Unfortunately, I am actually a college student myself and with very, very minimal finances. Um, so right now, I am limited only by the ability to fund the campaign. 
which is so far recently, the demand has been exceeding um, my ability to do such. I'd really love to not ever have to turn anyone away and say, no, I'm sorry, you can't have a wristband because we just don't have any, because we can't afford it or we can't ship it. Um, so I am sending out this video also to kind of plea for, for your support as well. There are different ways in which you can do that. Um, most likely, if you're watching this video, you have already yourself received a wristband. And if you would like, you can sponsor wristbands for other people, people that may not otherwise be able to receive one. Um, if that's something that you would not like to do, but you would like to help in another way, you can actually sponsor supplies that are used to ship wristbands, such as envelopes of different sizes and tape. Um, if you've received a wristband, you know of my affinity for tape. I like to secure the wristbands just so that they are not lost. Um, also, most importantly, these adorable little butterfly 64 cent stamps are the most commonly used postage um, for shipping out a wristband. Any of those supplies can be sent directly to the address listed on our website, rainbowdelegation.org, and contributions can be made through the website as well. I am hopeful that enough people will rise up to really help continue this campaign going strong as the momentum builds. I hear a lot about people talking about they, such as that's what they say, or you know, someday they're going to do something about this. And I want everyone to understand that every shift in, in history, every campaign, every movement that has changed the course of humanity has happened through everyday people like you and me taking initiative and doing something. You know, there is no amorphous committee of they that does everything. We are the they. And so I am hoping that we can really come together on this and make a difference and perhaps all the difference to someone. Thank you for wearing your wristband daily and thank you for your support.